This one here, you can try this. Yeah. The smallest is 10 k What you're seeing right now is a simulation of what happens in the marketplace, buying and selling. You have probably experienced it in Owino, right? Each of these people was given fake money and that's what they are using to actually do this exercise. At the end of the day, we shall tally their money and replace that with actual money. Is it new in market? I'm very sure this, your wife will love this. Hey! hey. hey. All right. This one. Where do you guys go? Airtime, airtime. Airtime. Some of these things are fun that's going on. You cannot even cannot see more than the price. At the end of the day, we are moving on a red carpet. Buy yourself a crossbar. Buy yourself a crossbar. Buy the crossbar. It's been an interesting journey, and today the four finalists will present their business ideas. This is Nyakasura School. We are bringing a business idea known as the Nyakasura Coffee Yogurt. Uganda's backbone generally is agriculture. That one we are much aware. Yogurt is made mainly of milk. We are adding in coffee for value addition. Our dear judges, Coffee Yogurt, this is the only brand in the whole country. No one should lie you, no one should bring up a fake brand that is Coffee Yogurt. It is only Nyakasura School that can produce Coffee Yogurt. Uh, the product, the name of our business is New Flame Energy Solutions. And the name of our product, we chose Echo Zap. Echo, we all know where that comes from. And Zap, uh, that is for the killing effect our product has on the mosquito. Uh, the product is a carbonized charcoal briquette uh, which has uh, mosquito repellent attributes and which at the same time has easy lighting mechanisms. It's not just any normal briquette you go and see out there. At the same time, it burns longer and more effectively than charcoal. Uh, this is the future of Uganda, this is the future of energy in Africa and I think all of us should vouch for such ideas in young people. We have an idea of dealing in the preparation and sell of food additives. If I speak about food additives, I'm speaking about spices that you can add to your food to increase the appetite or the consumption to be better. I want to hear you say, we actually went in the kitchen, we actually got the spices, we mixed them, you, you know, and this is what we're going to do for sustainability. We first did it hands-on when we were in senior five, when we had some time, but then we realized in form six we, have no, we don't have this time. Labor will come from students. Our business name is Smakoa Juice Blenders. Fresh juice, fresh minds. The main motive of our business is creating financial independence by combining our passion for juice blending and business skills. In the fourth position is Team Aboke. In third position is Team Nyakashura. In second position is Team Holy Cross. In first place is Team Smack. The fact that we were able to touch 21,000 children's lives and give them some life skill training in right. the soft things that really matter in the world out right. there right. Um, is a really important give back to society. Do you know many guys finish university and don't know how money works. Yes. Do you know what you've done today? Mm. You have made sure that theory is only 40% and practical is 60%. When, when you come to visit us, we shall have implemented the business using the money the bank has given us. The bootcamp comes to a close, but we're still going on. And on the next episode, you can come with me to the schools to find out whether the theory is now practical.